We told you they can't hide the truth forever. The history of our civilization is not only beginning to provoke human consciousness and imagination across the globe, but there is also growing evidence that structures on this earth are far older than the squeezed in time period of 5,000 years. 5,000 years of human history, that includes everything we have ever built, everything we have ever learned, and every one of us to be in the today and now. It just does not make sense and it stretches the imagination to the very boundaries of common sense. We can't just keep going along with this concept of evolution. It is impossible for this to be the case. The timeline of humanity must be taken into serious consideration when you think how delusional this idea of history actually is. But it probably is not deliberate. The elite of today probably are nothing more than the first of us to begin to wake up. But they have played their part in suppressing history since at least the French Revolution. Anyway guys, we wanted to make you aware in this video of the recent findings from the World Heritage Site of Stonehenge in England. An archaeologist has claimed that the standing stones are not 5,000 years old, but are older than anything we could ever imagine. Wait till you hear this. Humans were drawn to Stonehenge for millennia, but we were drawn here because we could not understand why they were there. They must have a purpose, that is for sure, but the very purpose in which they exist is probably lost forever, and there's a chance that we as humans would never understand why they are here because it would bend the very depths of our knowledge and understanding. These stones were here before humans, not built by us, so the question has to be, well, who put them there then? According to Graham Hancock, there appears to be evidence that Stonehenge contains measurements that are directly related to important measurements of the Great Pyramid. In fact, it may be that Stonehenge in some ways functions as a half-scale, two-dimensional echo of the Great Pyramid. Stonehenge is certainly more than a simple model of the Great Pyramid. But we should also consider the possibility that it somehow incorporates some of the information that ancient Earth inhabitants wanted to preserve in the Great Pyramid. There is evidence that the site of Stonehenge existed during the last Ice Age with shattering layers of sarsen stones caused by thawing and freezing of the permafrost over a sustained period of time and causing the huge stones to sink. This means that Stonehenge not only predates the conventional understanding of human history, it also means that they are far older than previously thought. They existed before the Great Flood and were present at Salisbury during the last Ice Age, which may be referred to as the Younger Dryas, lasting from 12,900 to 11,700 years ago before present. With this new evidence, archaeologists have been scrambling to explain this. There have even been startling claims that these standing stones occurred naturally. Isn't that astonishing? Did the pyramids also occur naturally? What Stonehenge is and why and how these massive stones were transported to where they stand today remains a profound mystery. There's little doubt that this is signaling more than just the solstice and equinox. It is amazing that even in the today and now, when so-called experts are presented with overwhelming evidence of the timeline of our civilization, they dismiss all the evidence that dates back before 5,000 years and suggest to us that this occurred naturally. What an insult to human intelligence. Times are changing, guys. These were just our thoughts, nothing more. Read the publication and tell us what you guys think of these findings. Comment below, and as always, thank you for watching.